Rubskin here, and it's time for Forgotten Fighters, where we talk about fighting games that have been forgotten. Yeah. yeah. And today we're talking about uh, a game that nobody fucking remembers. Yeah. We're talking about this game, Weapon Lord, which uh, has some really fucking badass cover artwork. I mean, that looks great. And it's really actually a pretty badass game, but nobody remembers it, you know? No, nobody remembers Weapon Lord, which is actually one of the very first weapon-based fighting games ever. And it's actually very innovative, and uh, you know, with its fighting mechanics, it is pretty fucking awesome. But, again, nobody fucking remembers it. Which is unfortunate, because, you know, if I got this game and I want to fucking play it, nobody remembers it, nobody can play it with me, you know? And it's not a very simple fighting game. No. No, 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 no. Unlike games like Mortal Kombat and Street Fighter, right? Mortal Kombat has a high and low punches and kicks and a block button, plus a whole lot of special moves you gotta memorize and stuff. And Street Fighter, right? It's got a whole different kind of uh, fighting mechanics, right? With uh, punches and kicks at different strengths and stuff. It also has a whole bunch of different special moves that you gotta do to do special attacks and stuff. But Weapon Lord wants to redefine the concepts of, like, blocking and attacking and basic fighting strategy, right? It's got a whole new fighting system with uh, new combos and, uh, actually, you can do a death combo. Death combo, where you, like, kill the guy, like, right away. It's a pretty interesting game, right? But you gotta forget everything you think you know about fighting games, right? Because it's a whole different system. I mean, look at the controls. It's like, uh, there's no punches or kicks. There's a uh, slash, thrust, and strike. Uh, back and four. Four, back, slash, and four, slash, what? Yeah, it's, it's like a back attack and a four attack. Back and four, right? With the fucking weapon. It's either a slash or a thrust or a strike. I don't, I don't fucking know. It's fucking complicated. Very fucking complicated. And I mean, the, the special moves for each character are entirely different, you know? You gotta do some moves where you gotta hold the button and then do like a movement with the joystick. Or you gotta do a movement with the joystick and then push the button at the end of the movement. It, it, it's really complicated, you know? I mean, like, how do you do this move? You do what? So wait, you want me to do this weird quarter, circle, then back again? While holding B thrust and B strike? Well, which buttons are B thrust and B strike? Huh? Uh, X and Y. Well, why, why doesn't it just say X and Y? Why does it say B thrust and B strike? You know, why does it just say X and Y? Is that too complicated? This is too fucking complicated. Seriously. And you know, with other fucking fighting games, like with uh, Mortal Kombat, uh, Street Fighter, you learn a couple guys different moves, and then, then you can use those with other fucking characters, you know? You know, you, know, you do Chun-Li's rapid-fire kicking move by tapping on the button really fast, right? Which is the same way you do Blanca's fucking electricity attack and E. Honda's, like, super slap attack, right? You know, and, and not entirely different moves for each character. Well, that's the way it is with fucking Weapon Lord. Each fucking character has entirely different moves, you know? So no, no two characters in the game have, have even this one move that's the same. It's just a whole bunch of different fucking button combinations and different, like, moves you gotta do with a joystick. It's fucking ridiculous. You know? I mean, even with Mortal Kombat, you know, Liu Kang's fucking fireball attack is performed the same way that Reptile's spitting attack is used. You know? That's what makes it fucking fun game. Weapon Lord is definitely not a game you can just pick up and play. No. You gotta do a lot of research. You gotta study a lot. You gotta memorize these fucking moves. Right? And then you wanna play the game. No, you gotta fucking practice. You gotta put it on two player. Right? And then, like, have nobody play in the second player. And just try out these fucking moves. They're so fucking complicated. Oh my god. You gotta hold down this button. And then do this fucking move with you. Oh my god, so crazy. That's so fucking crazy. You can even try it. Try some of these moves. Okay. Look at this. Oh, hey, it worked. 
There you go. Do it again. Yeah. Okay, now hit him with it. Gotcha. <laughs> Shoot me with energy balls. You're dead. Yeah. Well, you know, I like these characters, you know. The fact is, with Weapon Lord, you got a lot of beefy chicks in here, right? A lot of big, tough, muscly chicks that can stand toe-to-toe -to -toe with the guys in the game. In fact, there's as many girls as there are guys. You know what I'm saying? And the girls aren't over-sexualized in any kind of way. No, they look just as tough as the fucking guys do, you know? And this guy, actually, this guy kind of looks like the God of War. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, and they got wacky weapons. Really fucking wacky weapons. You know, not just like a sword or an axe, but uh, wacky fucking weapons. Actually, I'm not really showing you that much fucking footage of the actual game. I'm showing you mostly the instruction manual, because that's what I'm fucking looking at. I gotta look at the instruction manual, figure out how to do these fucking moves, you know? Figure out this weird fucking button combination, and not even actually playing the fucking game. I'm not playing the game, I'm just looking at the fucking instruction manual. What the fuck? I've been training with this bitch. Battle <laughs> Uh, but when I'm actually playing the game, then I'm just fucking mashing buttons, honestly. <laughs> I mean, all the complicated special moves, combos, and strategy just goes out the fucking window. And all six buttons do the same fucking thing. They all attack. Fuck the force, slash, thrust, slice, what, what, whatever. And, uh, they all just attack, just mashing buttons and trying to fucking do some damage to the opponent. I don't really know what the fuck I'm doing here. Ah. Shit, what are you doing? Ah. Come on. Fucking what? Ah, ah. Oh, come on. I am so fucked. Alicia. I didn't even get close. But it is a good game. I mean, it's got great graphics, sound effects, and buckets of blood. Yeah, it's a super fucking bloody game, but <laughs> I can't figure out how to do anything. Ah, uh, man. I'm doing something. Use fireball. I don't want the fireball. I mean, Weapon Lord is a good fucking game. It was actually made for... Hardcore fucking fighting game fans who fucking played and mastered fucking Street Fighter and Mortal Kombat and wanted another fucking challenge, you know? Wanted another set of fucking special moves to fucking learn. Wanted a new game to become the absolute king of. You know, and fucking play against your friends and stuff. But, uh, for me? Uh, not really. It's not really for me. You know, it requires too much reading and studying. It's not just a game you can fucking pick up and play easily. You know, we gotta master it first. I prefer games like Fatal Fury and Samurai Showdown. Now, those games just assume that you're a fan of fucking fighting games and have played Street Fighter before, you know? It doesn't try to reinvent the wheel, you know? It doesn't try to redefine the fighting game genre, right? It just kind of uses the same fucking fighting moves as Street Fighter, you know? You do this one move that does the Hadouken Fireball in fucking Street Fighter. Well, in Fatal Fury and Samurai Showdown, you know how to do that move, then you could do a bunch of other moves, you know? Yeah, it uses the same fucking basic moves. It does some other cool stuff. In, in fact, Samurai Showdown is also a weapon-based fighting game, just like Weapon Lord, you know? But it doesn't try to reinvent the wheel, you know? It's a game that's based on some stuff you might be familiar with, and that's what makes the game fun. Weapon Lord, it's a little too fucking complicated. You know what I mean? Oh. Uh. Yeah. But, uh, you know, maybe you might like it. You might like the fucking challenge. For me, eh. I don't really like it too much, but, uh, yeah. There you go. <laughs> Weapon Lord, another forgotten fighter for your ass. <laughs> anyway, till fucking next time, keep it real.
the dawn of time, man has battled. In an age of conquerors, the Demon Lord reigns supreme. Oh. Oh. the demon's power in the woods and then face him. Six warriors there to face him. Okay. Whore. Whore? <laughs> Felicia. Fla Felicia? What? Dork. Dork? <laughs> He's a dork. Dada. Da Me? Me? I don't know. Gentai. Got that one. Gentai. It was foretold one will live to meet the demon in combat, and the Lord of Demons will fall by the hand of the Weapon Lord. Uh, uh, okay. That's the legend of the Weapon Lord, apparently. The Weapon Lord is whoever can defeat the Demon Lord. Eh, makes sense. 